So, see a memes. We are calling out. We are memesing right here at VMC Planet Radio. And uh, you know, when it comes to poems, Dr. Faith Tabakale Raduba is a poet. He is the son of the soil. He is inspired by inspirations that comes through. And then uh, he writes his poem. And then he recites them for you to actually understand and be built up. Because when you talk about poetry, we talk about, uh, you know, words that almost are like a mirror where we look at ourselves, we look at our life, and then we reflect. So that's why we are having Dr. Faith Tobakari Raduba right here at VMC Planet Radio. And uh, the song you're hearing from the background is called uh, Memeza, you know. And uh, when you are memezing, you know, uh, Memeza, um, you know, it's either you're saying is to shout or to actually scream. Uh, you know, and um, I like the English language. We were talking about the confusing uh, sentences and confusing words where we were saying, you know, there are nuances that are there because you can scream and shout, but it doesn't necessarily mean the same thing. Dr. Faith Raduba, good evening and welcome to uh, VMC Planet Radio. Thank you very much, Mr. Stan and your team. What you are doing through the VMC Planet Radio is awesome. Thank you so much. And I want to thank even the listeners of VMC Planet Radio. You are our pride. Mm. And I want, I want to say again, thanks to the voices of Westrand who sang Memeza, a clarion call against gender-based violence. Mm. Thank you very much, Mr. Stan. You are welcome, Dr. Faith Tobakale Raduba. Now, Dr. Faith Tobakale Raduba, today we are talking, uh, in fact, before we go into our uh, poem, um, uh, words of wisdom from you, any motivation? Thank you very much. I will put it this way. When I was almost 22 years old in Soweto, I was standing in the four-roomed house next to the window. Next to me was a friend of mine and his girlfriend. Mm. As I was standing there, I began to balance against the window and the window and its frame fell off. Mm. And my friend and his girlfriend began to scream because they were afraid that the father of the girlfriend and the mother, when they came back, um, are going to really do something bad against what happened. Mm. As we were standing there, I began to say to them, let us do something about this. There is no need for us to scream or to cry. Mm. Now, what I want to say is there are two things. Never allow what happened to determine what should happen in the future. Mm. Never allow what Never happened. Never allow what happened. The window fell out. It's what happened. But to allow that to, depend, to determine the future, where people begin to cry and there is no hope, it is not supposed to be so. Never allow what happened to determine what should happen because what happened happens to everybody. What you do now about what happened is the one that determines your future. Mm. Mm. Attached to that mm. is don't worry about something you can do something about. Don't worry about something you can do something about. Thank you so very much, Dr. Uh, Faith Tobakale uh, Raduba. Now, um, the poem today is called, What is this dream that I have? What I want to say is, ask yourself this question. Because when the question arises, what is this dream that I have? It is not talking about the dream that I have only as Dr. Faith. It is all inclusive. You need to ask yourself this question. 
what is this dream that I have? What is this dream that I have? Fresh from the bowels of heaven, meandering and palliating a system of complications difficult to find. Through the maze of life, I couldn't wish it away. Confrontation is priceless discipline, painted with inherited, in inherent strength, rather, challenging the enemy's rights, power, authority, inclusive. What is this dream that I have? What is this dream that I have? Like a brand new horse, mighty and dicey, galloping near and far, shining in darkness, announcing the spark that lightened the world, turning it upside down and downside up. What is this dream that I have? What is this dream that I have? Troubling and troubling in me, attuned with nature's gifts, even load sheddings, causing restlessness, rewinding the untapped to be taped in this lifetime. What is this dream that I have? What is this dream that I have? Rooted in sacrifice, raised in white linen of perspiration, perseverance calling, shouting in the seaways, rejoicing in shared relays, won by those who endures, fertile artistically in manures, rarely enjoyed by sluggards. What is this dream that I have? What is this dream that I have drawing me closer to my foreclosure, though past principle broken in two, handing me keys tracked for the new heavenly car, a gift from the word personified, made flesh in our times. I have it. You have one too. What is this dream that I have? What is this dream that I have? Like rhetoric questions, faithful one and footprinted. Consider a prophet of old, beholding unclosed graves, the valley of the dry bones, hearing a sound like a mighty wind, a noise and a sudden rattling, bones coming together, bone to bone. Oh yes, the bones lived again. You shall leave. What is this dream that I have? What is this dream that I have? Longing to live in his assurance, always saying things in nowness of times as though they were. For I hear you again. You caused breath to enter in you. I live, rejoicing in my being, moving to the higher goal, fashioned are sinews to my bones, flesh upon sinews. You covered me with skin and breathed or breath through me again and again. What is this dream that I have? What is this dream that I have? Doing good, not doing chokes next, like an overdue debt, always for waiting for you, twittering answers in the valley of bones, dried by life's unsolved problems, there waiting for me. There waiting for me is yet to be conquered. What I conquered, what I conquered never waits for me. It's already mine. What is this dream? that I had. Bones were dry, hope lost, yet I live and I know. Therefore I coach. It is time to dream again, both wide and very high. It is time to dream again and be great before I die. It is time to dream again of empires great and vast. It is time to dream again of something that will last. It is time to dream again and accept God's sovereign will. It is time to dream again and move from being still. It is time to dream again and build my life anew. It is time to dream again. It is time for you and for me. What is this dream that I have? 
there will be no next time. We are in the business of one time, reaching beyond the impossible through the last will of Jesus Christ and his authority alone, without any sign of a cloud like a man's hand to dangle a carrot as to inspire the confession of a soon coming blessing and without any physical evidence whatsoever. I am Dr. Faith Tobakari Radova, always pushing myself to the next level of greatness in business and in the rarefied atmosphere of his best. Thank you very much, DMS, Planet Radio. Thank you very much, Mr. Stan. Thank you very much, listeners. Stay blessed, stay safe, and bye for now.